Hey Friend Reason YouTube, this is Rabbi speaking with the update video and I know I've done lots and lots of update videos but this is probably more important because I'm going to talk about like the good of this year like earlier this year and the stuff, the bad stuff that's happened this year. So, and also what my plans are for next year, for 2021. Now, now we've all kind of hated this year because of the virus. We all know about the virus and everything like that, the pandemic. But that's not what I'm going to be talking about, though. I mean, I'm not really going to talk about the pandemic that much, though. I'm just talking about, like, some of the other stuff that has happened. So, let's, let's get into the good stuff, though. Like, let's get into the good stuff first before I talk about the bad stuff that has happened to me. So, the good stuff, I mean... Obviously, I mean, I, I know it's obvious to you guys, and I've said this before, and you guys already see it, but, you know, I got the apartment earlier this year, though. I mean, I talked I talked about it before, how I got it and stuff, and I'm just really, really glad to get this, though. I've said this before, but I wasn't expecting to get this apartment this year, though, because of the other stuff that's been going on, but... If I've said this before in my videos and stuff, but... I think I might have said it on like Twitter about about my job. Basically, I got a job at my local gym. Basically, what I do is that I clean stuff. You know, I clean, especially right now. And I also help people out with machines and stuff, with weightlifting machines. So that's pretty much my job, though. It's a part-time job. And it, I mean, I've made some really good videos as well, though. That's another good thing. It's like I'm finally finding more of my footing on this, though. I mean, yeah, I already know how to do the Smash Your Pass videos. And the Neko Boy videos, which I haven't really done in a while, but I'm not going to get into that that much, though. But I've made a lot of great videos, though, especially the Rama one half video. That video got over a thousand views. In fact, I think we're at like 1.5k views on that video, though. Like, that's insane, though. That's my highest view video, and it's, it's inspired me to create more videos on classic anime though. I mean, Yu Yu show I really enjoyed Inuyasha, Big O, Revolutionary, you girly Tina, that's a mouthful. You guys know what I'm talking about though, but just I got to watch some really classic anime and I got to share it with you guys. So, that was really cool though. And you can bet though that I'm going to be doing more of that as well though. Just do more uh, more videos on classic anime though. And I got one video in the works though which I'll talk about later in this video and I also got to start my twitch account though I mean I know I haven't really done it that much I've only done it twice though but I mean I think I think I'm gonna go back to twitch pretty soon though I mean twitch is a lot of fun though but because of the other stuff that's happened I haven't really gotten to twitch that much but soon though I will get to twitch soon I think I kind of you know understand what I'm gonna be doing on twitch though and I'll and you gotta pay attention more to my tweets and stuff when I'm gonna be doing more uh, streaming and everything like that. So keep that in mind though. Let's talk about the bad stuff. And the first half of this year has been not that bad. The second half of this year though, that's when things start to go down. And basically, if you haven't really followed my uh, Twitter page, if you haven't been reading my tweets and stuff, basically I've had like two major losses. And what I, what I mean by that, though, is that I lost two really good people that I hold very close to my heart. Two family members. I lost my Aunt Phyllis, who was 91. I mean, she lived a pretty long life, though. But it's still sad that she's gone, of course. And I also lost my grandfather, my, my Grandpa Paul. And Basically, I mean, Paul and I, we weren't blood-related or anything like that, though. But because I lived in such a small town, I didn't really have a whole lot of family here, like blood relatives and stuff. So, so I eventually met Paul and also my grandma Millie, who, who you guys, I've talked about her before on my channel. Of course, I love my blood relatives too, of course. You know, my parents, my brothers, and all of them. It's just weird that he's gone. And, I mean, he had a long life too. I think 78. I, I guess you could say that's a long life, but... I was kind of hoping he would be around a lot longer, though. But yeah, I don't want to get I don't want to get emotional, guys. Though I don't, I'm that's not that's not what this is, though. I don't want I don't want to make this a really sad video, but I'm just glad to get that out of the way. Other thing about this channel, though, is that I haven't really been uploading a whole lot, though. Like, and what I mean by that, though, is that some of the videos 
you know, I've been taking breaks and stuff, though. Like, sometimes I'll be gone for, like, a week or two weeks or maybe even a month. In fact, that's what I've been doing since the Yu Hag Show review, though. And then before the Yu Hag Show review video, like, like I'd be taking these breaks, though. And, and I apologize for that, though. It's just that I've been feeling a little burned out. And sometimes with my job, it makes it a bit harder for me to feel some motivation to when you get home and to do videos. I don't know if you guys have that feeling or not, though, when you get home. Like if you're a YouTuber and you're trying to get home and you don't really feel the motivation to do a video when you get home from work. I have plenty of other friends who are going through the same thing as I am, though, where they feel burned out and they're trying to get themselves back on track. That's, pre that's pretty much what I'm trying to do right now, though. Next year, though, I'm going to make sure that I do that, though. The only way, it's not guaranteed, though, but the only way if I decide to take a long break, though, is in case if I get sick, though, like, you know, the virus, though, because I put myself close to people because I work in the gym, so you never know, though. I mean, I'm not, I'm not trying to jinx myself here, but you just never know, though. That's the only way I'm going to take a break, though. It leads me into, like, my goals, though. My goals for this channel, though. Like, what am I going to do? Like, what's my New Year's resolutions for 2021? Like, kind of just talked about my resolutions where I want to get myself back on track, though. Just doing more videos and not taking really long breaks, though. So, so I got that out of the way. Um, I do want to work more on my story, though. I keep saying this all the time, though. But I really want to get my story published this year though i can't guarantee it though i mean i know i keep saying all the time though like oh i'm gonna get my book published this year oh it's that year now so i gotta get it published this year i mean yeah i mean this year was kind of i kind of have more of an excuse not to publish my book earlier this year because because i got the apartment though so i wasn't really so i thought with all that though it was just too much but this year though i really want to do it though i've been doing more research and so I want to get that just published soon, though. I keep repeating myself, guys, but there's not really a whole lot more I need to talk about on that, though. But soon, though. Soon. I really want to do it this year, though. Another thing that I really want to do, though, I mean, I don't know if I talked about this before on the channel, though. I don't know if I talked about this in the videos, but I really want to do more collabs, though. I want to go back to doing collabs, though. I mean, just being part of this community, though, really inspires me to do more videos with them. Just doing collab videos. I mean, I haven't done a collab video in, like, such a long time, though. Maybe the Neko Boy or something like that, though. But I really want to do more, whether it's the Neko Boy or just a Google Hangout. Just anything, though. I really want to do more collabs, though, because I've made a lot of friends in the anime community, though. All these anti-tubers. I have, like, a shit ton of them, though. I, I mean, I'm losing count on how many I have, though. I think that's it for pretty much all my resolutions, my goals, my plans. Like, that's pretty much it, though. I've talked about the good, the bad, and the plans. And another thing that I really want to do, though, is that I really want to do a big shout-out to all my AnyTuber friends. I can't mention all your names because it would take a while because I've, there's so many of you. But for those of you who have been there for me, who have, like, tweeted back to me, like, I'm sorry for your loss. I'm sorry that you lost your grandfather. Thank you, because... It really meant a lot to me, though. Like, it just shows that I have a big support system. I mean, of course, my family has been there. You know, I've had friends who have been there for me, like Chandler, for example. Again, Chandler, thank you, man, for being there. That's why. It's one of the reasons why I really want to do class with you guys. Because you guys are just so amazing, though. Let's just hope next year is better, though. Let's just hope 2021 will be a better year, though. Maybe we'll go back to the way things were, though. Like, hopefully, people you know, start actually wearing their fucking masks. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. But other than that, though, I think I think that's all I have to say, though. Again, thank you, guys. Thank you, guys, for watching this video, for supporting me, for being there. Thank you. I'm Rob A., and may the Anime Force be with you.